Afternoon, Damien. I'm getting prepared for another final again. It's it's uh, it's nice to be back. I'm sure. God, you know, um, Slack Neil weren't done too many finals for years. So every final you get to, you always want to look forward to. It. You enjoy the build up and the week leading up to it. Um, trainings maybe just aren't as physical as they were weeks ago, but uh, it's always a good buzz around the club and. Uh, Everyone always looks forward to county final day. And last year, you played ball on the screen in the final, and it was a real battle. Um, you know, both defences on top. Your semi final seemed much the same, you know, and you eventually broke them down. Yeah, look, uh, ball on the screen, ball on the screen are a very strong team. They they had very good underage teams for years there, and uh, I think you're starting to see them younger starting to falter through to the senior team. Um, you know, it took them a many years to get there, but they're a, they're a very very good up and coming team. They've put a lot of work on. They've seems to have they seem to have a good management team with them there this year, and uh, they're going to be a force for years to come. They're a hard team to play against. Uh, they're a very physical team, as you said. And uh, look, we had to be on top of our game to come through the semi final, but that's that's the sort of games you want. You know, you you want to be playing them tight games. That's that's where you see your own character. And you have a few changes this year. Um, you'd said Therese isn't playing and Siobhan. And the team has sort of changed anyway, Damien. And this year is no different. Every every, every year we've lost players, you know. So it, it hasn't been a, a shock to us, you know. Therese took a year or two out for personal reasons. Um, Siobhan, great news, she's expecting in January. And uh but uh we have we've always had a big squad. We've had youth coming through. Um a lot of the girls had a bait wit and bide their time to make that breakthrough. Um but every year there's been one or two of the younger girls have stepped up and our team hasn't been weakened in any way. And I just I I'll put a lot of that down to the strength and unity that they're squad has we 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 have every confidence in every player that crosses that lane no matter who they are how long they've been playing senior Kamugi for and he's brought Tina in later on in the game um last week she's fit, fit yep. for a start this weekend we're we're going to do a fitness test tonight with her um she's just carrying a, a, a dead leg into the screening game and we don't want to risk it um so we will have a a fitness test, speak to Maury G in the night on her and we'll make a decision after training tonight. And what about Swatra? I know they beat you in the league decider last year. It was a fairly tight battle in the championship. I saw them playing Lavi, you know, they're no bad team. What's the thoughts going into it from the Slam Hill point of view? Look, hi, um, Swatra is going to be another tough battle with them. Um, you know, this last couple of years we've just just about got past Swatter and games, you know. They're a good, strong physical team. We know who their big players are and Grunga and uh Shannon, you know. So they're they're uh, main cog for their team and we know we have to be on top of our game to try and curtail them two guys. But it's not just them two guys, you know, Swatter like us, they have other players. Um they're not uh, just a two or three woman team. So, look, we've sat down, we've talked about Swatter's players, and uh, uh, we have a game plan on this. So, all been well. We come out on top tomorrow. Looking back through the years, Swatter had tremendous tradition uh, in Camogie. I, rem- I did an article during the summer just about you know how much they had won in a row and. Um, and you said earlier in our interview there, like Slaneil used to never win Kamogi titles, so yeah, it's very much a contrast. Yeah, that's it's probably you could say the same, and you know, on every code and every club, it swings and roundabouts. Every club, you know, has has a stage where they, you know, they maybe one, two, or three, and they become a bit of a dominant force. But you know, most clubs can't maintain that every year. You know, not every club's across McLean or something like that, you know, but, uh, you know, that's that's why I, I, I enjoy these 
championship ones, you know, we'll, you know, we've enjoyed our dairy ones as much as we have our Ulster ones or all Ireland ones because every championship one is a bonus. You know, you don't know when these when these days are going to leave you again. So I would always tell the girls to enjoy, you know, enjoy the success while it's here because it, it never lasts. I was say the last family is run, you lost it. Last year's all Ireland, so yep. I oh hey, you know, uh, on 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 their day, uh, any any team can beat us. You know, we're we're not we're not cocky enough to think we're unbeatable. We know we have to bring our A game to every game, and especially with us being at the top, every team wants your scalp. So if we don't work hard enough, if we don't put the the hard work on a training, if we take our foot off the gas in games. We know we, we can be caught, and it's just uh, it's just find that fine balance of getting everything right. And finally, as you say, you're you're going in with a favourites tag again, but it's it's not new at this stage. No, it's not. It's not new. You know, um, we 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 don't think of us as favourites. You know, we go into every game, we prepare for every team individually. You know. We've prepared for Swatter the exact same as we played for Newbridge in our quarter final. You know, we don't uh, take our foot off the pedal for any team. We prepare for every team individually. We work hard on training on what we want to do during that game, different matchups we want to try and form. So, um, look, we know it's going to be a tough battle. And But as I say, we're confident. I wouldn't say just because we're favourites, but. Uh, we're confident on the day if we get everything right, we, we, we can come out on top. Amen. Thanks very much for your time. No bother, Ma. Thank you.